Hello, and welcome to day 13 of our Esri Leaflet Advent Calendar tutorial series. Today we'll be looking at how to zoom the map to fit all the features in our feature layer and highlight them within a bounded area. We'll soon get into the code, but first let's answer this question. Why would we want to zoom the map to fit the data and show a bounded area? Imagine you have a map with multiple features and you want your viewers to see the entire data set at once without manually zooming in or out. This is where zooming to fit the data becomes crucial. It provides an optimal viewing experience, ensuring that no feature is left out or hidden. Now let's get to the code. We'll start with the basic feature layer code that we made in day three. Now, because the data set I've been using of haunted places is so large, I've chosen to use a smaller data set this time to showcase data in a more limited area. This feature layer is a set of streetlights in the county of Arlington, Virginia. Now, to locate where and how wide our data set spans, on our feature layer, we'll use the query.bounds method. This takes in a function with error and lat-lang bounds parameters. To set my map's view to fit within the proper bounds of my data set, on my map, I'll use the fitBounds method and set the bounds. I'll next create a box variable with the bottom left and top right corners using my lat-lang bounds parameter values. Then I'll create a rectangle that contains the box values and add this to my map. I'll open this up in the browser and see my bounded area of features. For today's challenge, try experimenting with the bounded box by changing its styling based on various features. Share your creations in the comments below. And that wraps up day 13. Tomorrow we'll look at how to zoom to a specific subset of features using where SQL statements. Thanks for watching and happy coding.